Good evening, listeners. It's Thursday, March 23rd of 2023, and the second day of autumn. You're listening to 3CR Community Radio, broadcasting from and across the Black, sovereign countries of the Kulin Nations. My name is Sister Zai, your co-host on Inity Rhythms on every last two Thursdays of the month. Shout out to my co-host, Sister Levi, who is in the control tower every other Thursday of the month. Today, we listen to part two of the interview with Randy Valentine. Part one, if you missed it, is available from our radio on demand function, which you can access from our website, 3cr.org.au forward slash Inity Rhythms. Randy Valentine is a UK based artist, producer, singer, and the head of Truth's Music, a label he runs out of London. He caught up with Identity Rhythms in 2022, almost a year ago now, just a few months following the release of his project, The Highest Rock. So much more music has been released since then, but we're going to revisit this interview because a lot of the wisdom is still quite relevant to his latest releases. We had a chance to discuss all things music, music production, and the philosophy behind his genre breaking genre-expanding album, The Highest Rock. I hope you enjoy. <laughs> Traveling is an old time tradition. It's, 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 it's what made the lines, you know. Yeah. Before the lines. Before they were named. I like I like saying I come from a place but where before they were named. Yeah. Yeah, you know. So I won't identify myself as somebody that's living up somewhere across from me. If I'd live like that, then Africa wouldn't be a place that I'd need to get to. Africa would be where anywhere I stand. And we've heard that in the narrative so many times, but it's so hard to practice when we have to get to it. <laughs> you know? Yeah, it's mad. I love that. Mm-hmm. 
do you do you still feel like you need to get to it or you can be in it and of it i still i i am um, uh when i heard a man said al kebulan a few weeks ago and he said yeah that's what it was called before they called it that and i said wow i love that again traveling keeps introducing me to the wider narrative so getting into spaces where i can be exposed to wider conversations is somewhere i always feel like i, I love getting to I, or love being i love being that also so being it makes it something that i never have to reach so it's like this conversation i enjoy meeting people where i get this exchange but this this exchange is never far away from me because people tend to enjoy our exchange mm. yeah so it's, the lights are always close so you don't have to get to the bliss you be the bliss and it's always present wow wow i don't know i don't i struggle with that yeah mm mm when i if i ask you you say i said yeah, i said i said it's love and you say it's love i say it's love like it's always present and you say yeah it's true i ask you what you love that's never left you Well, what is that? Where is it? What is it? What do I love that has never left me? I mean, look, for me, it's music. Let's put it there. It's sound. Let's put it there. It's, it's uh, then, words. It's story. Yeah. Then if you find out you ever get lonely, there's probably know that it's not that it's left you it's probably that uh, yeah that's true actually that makes sense yeah I see that. yeah you're a bit away from it it's, 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 it's yeah it's never not there you know love life some people just find it in nature when people find it in nature they find it easy i love birds <laughs> i love the birds i love what they remind me of i love parrots i love the fact that they're they 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 show how blah 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 the, the languages cuz even the birds could do it i love that i love that they i love how they fly i love how we seem so supreme yet not so fascinated by these things you know I love that nature is always at work. I love that we are a part of it. Mm. I love how we love to see ourselves outside of it. I love that I can recognize that. You know. How do you come to space with so much compassion? Uh cuz it's there's none without the other. When I recognize myself as outside of it, I probably then want to become lord of the moment. <laughs> <laughs> I like oh uh, uh oh whatever i can tell myself you know i love a man said that you know when it's so wrong we give it to god when it's so bad it's us all is all on us i also love when a man said uh, the mind be careful of the mind that says when when it's so strong i am strong when it's weak it's where we are yeah. to be able to listen to our language what language does to expression yeah and projected moments and that science allows me to have compassion because i i could see the misunderstanding in the moments very easily mm. yeah. yeah no it's um yeah it's profound like everything you're saying i'm just like wow i'm just sitting with it and all absorbing mm-hmm.
content in the highest rock yeah. <laughs> I, don't across, I don't come across lyrics like that very often wow it you comes know? to travel respect thank you for that because and and i'll say it this way there's conscious music right but yeah. sometimes i feel like with any kind of writing the challenge for the writer is to step outside of the, the metaphors that everyone's used to yeah to extend them yeah really to apply them differently and then to find new ways of phrasing it and it seems like you managed to do that in this project yeah <laughs> I, I, you know you are right <laughs> <laughs> you are let's say that you know, let's say that uh, um, I really worked really hard on this project. I put, um, and let's say a good eight years into this project. It feels like that because I'm like, this is not, this is <laughs> yeah. not like 
oh, just three months, I'll have it done. <laughs> no, it's a long time. Before I started got, being, um, let's say, recognized as an, as an artist for singing reggae music, you know, I was always producing acoustic soul, um, something with a, a hip hop or a jungle or r and flavor, or just pop sound or electro pop sound. That's what comes from just being in the UK. You're surrounded by the melting pot. You're in it, you know? So every five, every other five years, there's a new genre that happens within this space. Mm. So the, the sound is always moving, like the groove is always moving. So I learned a lot of that and I added a lot of that in the writing when, I, when it comes to writing reggae music. Right? I, I, I like the, the construct. So I always work on how I'm constructing the song. I, I, take, I take pride in that. But then the overall instrumentation and all of these things, it took a while to just really learn it, how to bend sound, bend synthesizers. And, really mix a drum a thousand times before you say, yo, I love this sound, mm. you know? And listening to a lot of Kanye West and having uh, one of his lines that when he said, five beats a day for th- five beats a day for three summers. I took that personal. Whoa. Yeah, yeah, and then I just started working on beats, five beats a day, five beats a day, six, seven, eight beats a day, just working on just sounds and yeah after that came the project you know so the project is just an extension of just the constant repetition So we are visionary, visionary, yo, visionary. How precious is the water from the spring? Infinitely flowing through the queens and the kings that coming from the hills. Make way for man, a visionary, visionary, yo, visionary. How precious is the water from the spring? They got to help me sing, oh, yeah. I see clear my dream. So I go after that Now I'm gonna make them drain my energy Cause I'm not born for that I have to go out Cause I'm not want to go on my yard Without the food from it My mama smile right So I work hard to be Build a pulse in the place where me live I run with poverty I have to rise up with the world to graffiti Stay here I feel different with the difference a lot of people now can see it If them not see the difference Jack him on my defense When them come with love, they smile and then see it Say them a pretend I see the vision Time for unity No time for the vision Chilling from the day Smoking night grade, that was the vibes on the bill Yeah Visionary oh. Visionary Man, oh. Visionary oh. Visionary how precious is the water from, from the spring Infinitely flowing through the queens and the kings That coming from the hills oh, Make way for him and a visionary Visionary, oh, visionary How precious is the water from the spring May God to help me sing, oh yeah One day, I am visionary So I see there, my dream I see there Yeah, I'm a visionary. Yeah, I'm a visionary. Visionary. Yeah. 
there's layers to this. I mean, there's the traveling, there's the you who's been working on your uh, your skills as a producer, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, there's, I mean, within all of that as well, your own personal self-development. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So there are layers. I mean, there's so many layers to this, but just getting back to like the, and, and I understand the connection between the beat and the yeah. lyric, right? Yeah. The beat and because the beat supports the narrative, the narrative supports the beat, whichever way you want to look at it, right? Yeah, 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 true. But to reach, to be able to create something that is really like genre breaking, yeah, right. And just listening to you and how you work as a creative, a creator. Yeah. There's a lot of internal processing that has to happen. Yeah. To get there. Like it's not, this is not easy work. This is the stuff that people (laughs) I think don't even talk about is like the internal journey that a creator has to go through the transformations, the letting go, expanding. Letting go, the EQing, the compressing, <laughs> sometimes the reverb, <laughs> all of that, <laughs> all of that internally. This is true. This is true. Yeah. This I've never true. heard it expressed that way, but that's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the fine tuning, man, the fine tuning, on the internal fine tuning. I recognize a lot of that for working on sound as well. How do you Making. stay grounded in that yeah. energy? Because that can get stormy. Yeah, it done. It, it, yeah, it is a storm, peaceful storm. Uh, are you, it's peaceful. You're lucky. Yeah. Mine's not peaceful. It's. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, I, and then. Uh, uh, <laughs> So I had to write my way to then the still point. Yeah. Uh-huh. Is where the still point came into play. I had to um uh, learn to see there's a thing called the super heterodyne receiver that can split frequencies into two. So you're able to see both ends. You can split a negative into two and then see it from both ends. You can split a positive into two. So I, I, I see, I, from reading that, it's like I just did a quick flip and then I start seeing my mind as the instrument. And now I have to apply myself in the moment in splitting frequencies. And then, so even if I am a storm, I can, I, I, I can accountability comes into play because mm. I can split and see where the person is present and what they're applying to the moment and also my perspective. And sometimes where I want to be right and how, me being right doesn't make the moment right. I see this in practice. And then so I don't always want to be right. But sometimes I, I learn how to allow. So as stormy as I am, I allow. And so then you find people that ride the stormy wave. Yeah. Yeah, you know. Ride the stormy. I'm just writing that down. <laughs> <laughs> ride the stormy wave, you know, because it's, it's okay. I love that splitting the frequency so you can see both ends. Yeah. Yeah, Yeah, because that's the duality of life, right? Yes, in truth. And you could get caught up in it, or you could just understand it as all coming out of one. One. So how do you see the one? How do you um, not become either the yin nor the yang? Yeah, you probably become... Either the, the line that holds them together in the middle. Or when you look at the scale, not many people see themselves as a the thing that's holding both things together. So true. Yeah. You see yourself as something on either end. What's holding it together? And that's the Lord of the moment. That's what you could either become or that's what you could even honor to override the pressures of the moment. Yeah. Yeah. The tilting of the scale that's so yeah i've never thought about that 
the actual yeah. access. The actual yeah. access. Yeah. You know? And and because um, we're yeah. so we're so obsessed with balancing. Yeah. Like oh the size the oh let me just put a little more oh no no now it's I don't <laughs> yeah yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> caught up yeah, yeah, instead of just saying oh let me just you know make sure that the the thing that holds the entire yeah, scale man, that's it that thing yeah. I don't even know what that thing. thing is. I'll have to look for that. I don't, know, I don't even know what that thing is. <laughs> but if it had a name, then yeah, man, that's the thing. We should actually right. just want to be more. Yeah. Right? That thing. Yeah, that's the thing. Because what's coming to mind right now is like an image of my art. Yeah. Right? Beautiful. The balance. Yeah. And yeah. that's true. It's like the goddess is there. Like she's in the center and the wings yeah. are either side, right? Exactly. Or when she's represented as the scale. Yeah. in afterlife you know mm -hmm. uh, yeah she that is her that is she yeah that is she yeah that's beautiful why are you made yeah, that body that where are you made what are you made the truth I speak the language of the universe yeah I do boy The symbolism in there that I don't quite get yet, but I'll get there. <laughs> <in a bit. laughs> 
I think I, yeah, I put, I get to put, because I immerse myself in the art, I get to put a lot of what I don't get to say in, in, in different ways. Oh, uh, so you I, do. I That's what I thought. I was just like, I'm sure there's something in here, but I'm just not getting yeah. it. Okay. Yeah. Now you trust me, you're getting it, man. We'll be listening in English. You know what I mean? Trust exactly. me, when you're feeling it. You're, when you're feeling it. You're feeling it. You're feeling it. I'm telling you, it's beautiful. That's why we're having this conversation. It's bigger. It's bigger than, than you know, than just us saying that we want to. There's so much at work. Yeah, there is a lot. What yeah, is that lot. feeling, though, Ren? What is that? <laughs> like, I wish <laughs> I can't explain it to people. Like, yeah. I don't know what that is. I, I don't know if it's just some folks have it, other mm. folks don't. If we all have it, but maybe we haven't, like, practiced it accessing it being receptive to it open to it but what if it's that is it's it's in the undefined yo i'm looking at something that because i can't define it i can't express it and that is so it's it's punishing to me but it's it's it's, it's i'm looking at light and when it's moving so fast and covering the space it's like they're speaking of what did they say? What is light? What is darkness? Darkness is the absence of light. Right? That's it, right? Yeah. Darkness is the absence of light. Yeah. And what is light? The presence of darkness. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just looking at it from, a, from the other end. I think we, we should have this conversation another time. But there's something that I'm looking at that, and I, that I'm, where I get to see, I'm trying to see things beyond the, the space without the concept or the construct of time involved and in shaping that perspective yeah. and the concept of many different things involved in shaping a moment and trying to introduce that as a concept to make it it's, it's a simpler understanding there's something i'm getting to that i got to from getting to the still point from saying there's a place beyond the opposites yeah where there's no up no down good or bad joy or sadness yeah yeah, it's neither close nor far, no peace, no war. It's just shapeless, shapeless. So that's why it's hard to give it form, to give it to you in a concept, because it doesn't hold form. But then it the lyric matter. video is just that. It's like you're you're looking into somebody's eyes ah, the entire okay. time. Yeah. And so it's an invitation to like just look deeply yeah. and to connect yeah. deeply. <laughs> yeah. And that, and that, when you do that with a person, like, you know, performance artists have done it, like, yeah. where you just, and we, this is something we don't do because people don't stare into each other's eyes. Yeah. Don't allow that level of intimacy where everything falls away. Yeah. And it's just the essence. That's what I get when I watch, when I watch the video and listen to the lyrics. I think when I watched the video, that's when I really understood the lyrics. That's when the lyrics really started like to, yeah risen mm. is that yeah. what you're getting is that what it is that's what i got from the clip because i just sat down and just i'm searching through what what do i want to use as the the, the backdrop from the, the clip you know and i saw his eyes you know i saw and then it's like i met his ten thousand. Mm. that's it just from a clip and I said, here is someone that, that I could, I've never met, but that could have the same conversation, you know, and I could use the words that express in the same, same, same song. Mm. And he could see the same story through his lineage, his, his, his line of 10,000 that were singing the same song, the same hum, the same, mm, the same hum. Yeah. Mm. I love if we could reshape the letters in our words and if we then say the same thing if we would then has have the same resonance you know to see how that's something you get from like if that's like um you're making me think of mantra right yeah yoga and just like the primordial sounds the sounds that created the universe yeah right yeah. um sounds I love how that sounds. That's what I'm, and because I, I feel like that's what, that's what that feeling is. It's like the mm. body still remembers, still has yeah. receptors mm -hmm. 
or the frequency before there was language, because there was a time before language. Mm -hmm. Or it's just that communication is how we communicate, how we understand communication. How, how everything else is probably communicating in a different way, but our, you know, just, I don't know how we're perceiving it, how we're understanding life, how we're understanding the unfolding. If it's unfolding, if it's not just still mm. and all it is, as time introduced us to move. Time. That's it. Yeah. Well, I'm looking forward to hearing your um, project or work <laughs> that manages to tackle the issue of time because that is a concept that really rules the way that yeah. we move. Like, the entire world is hypnotized. Yeah, in a coming and going state. Yes, you know, and and yeah, self perception is all about mm. time too, right? Because yeah. the metaphors we live by, yeah. time is money. Yeah. Um, Where are um, we going? Who do you want to be? Yeah, yeah. Everything yeah. is determined by that. Yeah, to be coming and yeah. Yeah, and I mean, we we fall prey to it very easily. There's a lot of yeah. fear around it. It takes us away, I think, from accessing yeah. what's real, what's true. Because I mean, I don't know how far <laughs> people want to go with this, but if you if you choose to see time as the illusion, because it's it's not yeah. real, it's man made, right? Mm -hmm. Person made. Then if you if you choose that story, if you choose to follow the story where time is a foundation, you're choosing the illusion. Yeah. And it's happening. But then I see it as nature at work because I don't see man operating outside of nature. I see, <laughs> man, I see man's mind like a bird's wings. Yeah. Yeah. It's, and it's just that magnificent and so beautiful and so and so it's hard to encompass in thought how it works mm. it just is and as you know and it just is you know so i don't i don't i don't i can't sometimes i don't i don't we're wrong and right you know i think we're all just like rats digging our own holes <laughs> better not yeah. to intellectualize too much yeah, 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 you know, <laughs> yeah, we're just how we're doing it. I like everything else is doing it from an from a animal to a wild bush. Yeah, to a flower. Yeah. Our nature affects it, how it affects nature. Here we are. Yeah, that could be a, a wild thing, you know. But then again, here we are. Mm. So when you made um the truth. Oh, that either, you know? <laughs> yeah, well. Yo, make it up sweet. Wow, that's it. Quick to tell a man you better make better choices Don't get paralyzed by your paral life Me, I'm living pharaoh nice I can fly around your world in an hour twice Stay loaded it like our dices Beast mode Jack gave by the cheat code You need that for these roads Good energy you need that for me bro Talk, talk, you can get that from me bro Talk shit but you can't talk to me though You best check your ego Better yet, you can say what you like I'm a bird in the sky, who am I? The owl or the ego? Them one who's them peep through them peephole Me, I stay covered in love by the people Traveling, ducking them javelins And ha ha at all manner of evil I can't stop, I keep going because they need more We want peace and trust me, we don't need war I saw hate in the gate and took a detour I saw hate in the gate and took a detour Been to Africa, now I'm back with the C4 And then I hit them with the yard man question like Oh you are gonna lock me out when pan the black man Who the man where you have the key store The one that comes straight from a deep core Man I'm man out here on the street sport Man I'm man out here trying to respawn Some of my friends can't, that's why we mourn 
Pour libation for the closed eyed nation. The schemes I gotta get mine, I ain't waiting. Go get yours, I ain't hating. I'm a five star, I am ancient. It's no hospital, I am patience. Defined, I'm sick with line arrangements. I'm not talking lines of pavements. I'm talking these lines of cadence. You can't be divine, stay dense. You're not in the presence of greatness. Like, I strip cash if I'm buying that great bins. Cause we don't do leases. I gotta look, look for you leeches. You're gonna look what? Who's preaching? That man is sneaky. We won't sneak in. I know they wanna attack tell them we never let like Baba Jag up with back. Baba Jag up with front and I left off with stuff. We get back and we relax. Back, so we do it like this, and we do it like that. And everything brisk, so we do it with Jack. Feel the most nice energy in my taps. It's not just about checks, it's about respect. Don't give me that butt energy, cause I'll give you that back. Come on. This side sounds so amazing. After all that we've seen, to start i i mean i want to talk about the, the, sure. the tracks that yeah. have videos attached to them but yeah. even <laughs> understand like I, I was just like wow this is such a massive project it clearly took a long time to create yeah like, dude yo in terms the of prayer. just like the music like everything is just it's fresh yeah the the the, the prayer the the, the drum that. and bass infusions uh, let's start with the prayer the prayer you've done the that prayer. before you did that in your other project you started with yeah. almost yeah, like a meditation or a prayer so it's almost like this is a little bit of a signature or something that you do to open yeah, yeah. it's uh the start of the conversation i'm introducing him into um my thought patterns mm. yeah and it's like a welcome mat you come to your house you see we have a welcome mat but you have spikes you know <laughs> I, have a, I have a nice welcome man saying let's have a conversation they probably get offered a tea or something you know it's 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 calm and so it's, it's making room for wider conversation i don't like to approach it as in i'm telling telling you something my, my parents didn't tell, tell me anything like tell me i'm not telling you know even if they said it most of what i learned from them wasn't from the telling it's the practice you know we learn it's from what we see from them in their practice. So I learned not to shout my thing. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. Top of the morning, you know? I'm here thinking. I met some beautiful people in this life. There's a lady that I met and prompted me to write this this morning. That's what she said to me, you know. She said, black people are put in a position to keep black people in a position. And she said that to me, yo. I started questioning all uh, the people I grew up admiring, you know, like my 
sometimes I wonder it's just that They were just trying to find a way out like everyone else, you know Never miss your train I pray you learn to love and never get addicted to the pain I pray that you're the son that people see when they're stuck in the rain Young queen, young kings Your royalty is in your veins mm. I pray you never lose your life wow. I pray you get to that space where you don't ever have to fight Proud Remember you're a crowd, keep the crown That last piece should be the dap. Pray the world never breaks your back. Like my father. Black people, is this the same? <laughs> it's the same yeah, it's one, just, isn't it? Yeah, it's the same one. You know what? Another thing, the whole album is wrapped around that one line. <laughs> okay, all righty. Because yeah. that's the one that popped. Yeah. I was just like, yeah, black yeah. people are put in a position to keep black people in a position, in which position. for yeah. me, like, I mean, look, that hits home so hard. How did you take it? How did you take it? Well, I mean, look, my family is middle class from Africa. So yeah. we were put in a position to keep black people in position. And yeah. I, you know, when I was studying at university, I I was researching how that happened. I was researching yeah. the the um the social um engineering that went into creating the social class that I come from. I yeah. was in an institution that was that was training me to think a particular way so I would go back and yeah. Uh, and structures that would keep people in a position but make them think they could become like me because apparently I'm freedom, right? Yeah, <laughs> you, become, yeah you become the benchmark for that. It's true right, right? Yeah. <laughs> so as a traveler, as somebody who travels, right? And is constantly yeah. looking for myself um, and had to leave my home yeah. to figure out what was up. That fascinates me. And, and it's because it's, to me, that's my journey in my journey to coming home to myself, which is mm-hmm. coming home to my ancestors, my journey to completing the decolonization process, right? That our yeah. ancestors initiated a hundred years ago when they started fighting 150, 60 years, however long ago it was, yeah. is to really get in my mind and to release and to, to let go of some of this conditioning that keeps black people in a position mm. you know, so it's so when i read i was just like okay cool i'm done with this let's 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 listen to some more of this <laughs> <laughs> yeah <laughs> that's love that's love that's love i i love that and that was a real conversation that happened to me you know it's, that i was a part of a travel from a, a person that was heavily involved in um let's say modeling and media and she learned that from her, from herself how was she was a poster for the moment and the perspective that she had to carry whether it become she had to paint a struggle or paint anything just something that identified as this so then she can then enhance the narrative that this is a real thing that's transpiring and this is all that is transpiring and in you know and they have that like a, a lot of who i am is American before I even got to America. 
you know, before I even got there. Um, I had to, there's a song I want to share so bad. It's a, your story goes further than the days of Mississippi. Yeah. Yeah, man. If it's supposed to go anywhere, <laughs> if it's supposed to go anywhere, according to the construct of time, then there's so much more to think about. And when I went to Ghana, I went to Ghana because I wanted to feel that and not hear the story. That's why when the new narrative came in, couldn't hold on to that I am becoming all I heard when I was meeting that the world was wider than my understanding of it. So I had to say, no, let me not hold on to so much which is fading. The more I travel, the more I open myself you know, to, to understanding more. Let me not hold on to anything to say this is final and so tangible. True. Yeah. So a lot of things started to shift with more and more I travel. I want to go to Ghana and not go to the designated spaces and, and go experience life beyond the history points. You know, the, 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 the checkpoints that history gives us. Mm -hmm. 20 years from now, when you're thinking, let's say 20, let's put it in a space where history really looks at and cherishes. I say 150 years from now, what happened the last two years, you probably will not be so present in the story. Your, who you are will be wrapped up in who your leader was. Your whole existence, your whole I am, your whole moment becomes wrapped up in a major moment and who was leader at the time. And yeah. this is how we, yeah, all of history before has got no families of the everyday people is all wrapped up in the great person in the moment. So I have to say, hey, well, what's happening? Where am I? Where's my grandmother? Where's my mother? Gotcha. So I, yeah, so I stay there. And that's what keeps me grounded. I don't become too much of the wide world, even when I'm traveling it. I'm not shaped by it. I realize I am the essence that shapes it, I, or a part of it. The essence that shapes it, but I, uh, it's, it's hard to then become and allow my all to become the world that I'm surrounded by. Yeah, yeah, like that's um, I guess some folks here would say that that's like I don't know. This is putting labels on things, right, and categories and whole ways of thinking and stuff. So I'm just putting that out there. But you know, some I think some folks might understand that. Mm -hmm through like it's a very feminist way mm. of writing history it's her story so, mm. where you don't look at the big men and it's always men <laughs> yeah yeah true always it's men true. being champion in moments and it's always war yeah it's always war yeah, yeah. Always men. um and it's never about <laughs> everything that is in your work which is life and regeneration mm. and um, self-actualization mm. um, and then from another perspective as well it's about centering the voice or the person the like the cultures specifically that have been left out of that big man mm. version of history mm -hmm. right and so making your your life and your people and your origins in Clarendon, right? Mm -hmm. Kind of central. Yeah. Is that, is that, am I understanding? Yeah, I make, I make family, family, I make um, what, the things that connect me to life. Mm -hmm. So I bring it back to my mother and my father. And uh, it's just hard to go. Even. Yeah, just, just even with my, my community, yeah. I get access to my community through my, my parents. Yeah. This walk that I'm doing, this gateway, I never leave the gate. I never leave, I never knock on at the gate in the process that allowed this upward walking. And if, if I stay there, then everything else is just the bonus to, you know, living. Yeah, and that, that's, that's what I think, that's what keeps my lights on. <laughs> I, think that's, I think that's beautiful. I think it's, it's, um, 
It's right. I hope that the comments I'm about to make will not offend the questioner too much and some people around here. I think there is a fundamental misstatement of the issue in the question. We can no longer continue to make policy for ourselves, in our country, in our region, in our continent on the basis of whatever support the Western world or France or the European Union can give us. It will not work. It has not worked and it will not work. We should be able to finance our basic needs ourselves. Stepping at the place with my African smile. Jamaica born, I'm an African child. But me put in at the border to the African style. Lying in my blood so the African wild. I had to take a trip to Ghana cause I wanna put my foot in at the African style. And I'm sure I'll have my children walk along the shores of the African land. Stepping at the place with my African art go deeper than black cause the African smart. Things and time change so when them write history, them have to go tell you about the African part. African queens and African kings. The whole world want what the African bring. Make the sunshine from your African skin and reveal the light with your African blade. There's so many, so many young people tashes that are yet to mature. And fight the new devil at every level in the rumors of war. Buckles and get nervous And Delilah could have tripped with the wine up You see the fire but you never see the gas Now the phoenix rising from beneath the ash Can't buy a real house so you better keep your cash This ain't dance the teacher feet are dash There's no escape but when you proceed for dash We don't lose your mind but I will leave you wash And for every child you are gonna receive her uh, There's so many, so many Young queen singers that are yet to mature I'm 
don't have that you know i know i know they don't and it's not to say you know so they might find it challenging to access but i think it's important to have visions of that anyway because yeah. it's what's been taken it's it's the um yeah it's part of the wound that comes with colonization is that our families and our communities get fractured yeah you know and so to to have that vision of and i'm sure it's not like always you know daisies and <laughs> sweetness no, no it's not but it's family yes yeah. so it's, it's definitely not daisies man <laughs> yeah but definitely not daisies but it's family it's family it's the relationship that the daisies has to have with the with the earth to form that union it's family yeah and i think you know for some folks how that comes through is chosen family because some some family systems you know like yeah yo it's just too much <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah but, but i feel where, where it's at if then if we're looking at the, the deconstruction of family we just say where it's at there's a ripple effect of it not being present enough so i i i see it and then i i i, I can have share compassion yeah and that's why I'm, I, I champion so much more accountability so it's not that i even want to see the whole world in a family i said i think of the family that i can create i think of the family that i could build to then impact this space my mind is you know, i won't wrap my mind into the wider world i'll cherish the fact that i'm experiencing you from that divine practice and yeah. every person that i experience is I'm meeting you from your gateway. I'm meeting you from your gateway. You know? So when we do that, it's like, how can we then say some people don't have it? We just know that, nah, man, these, it, we, they've done so well with just breaking down families and breaking them down that you could even speak to your own mother. And while you're speaking to your mother, you're telling your mother that I feel so alone. You know? We're so far away from it. Yeah. Imagine if we, we, when we were praying and, and the, the divine, the, the God, the, the great essence that we recognize to get to it, we'd have to pray by looking into our mother's eyes. What would that do to the world? Yeah, but Randy, your relationship with your mother shapes that yeah. view. Yeah, yeah so, so, so I'm coming with some old school information and that's why I shout it. And then I said, okay, then go love your mother. If not, then look forward to becoming that beautiful thing for someone. Yes, that's it. Like, look forward to becoming that beautiful thing. So it's almost like you're, but for some folks as well, you know, creating a family is not an option. Yeah. You know, and so nice for them, then it becomes like chosen family, like the folks you pick to, to go through life through and to be there for one another, you know? then you're still not far away from it. You are that gift that came from that practice. Exactly. You can't escape it. You can't escape the bliss. <laughs> well, it's it's, it's there. Go ahead. Sorry. So I would say like, what, what, oh no, no, please don't apologize. Um, it's just a conversation. We're getting excited. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I think what I would say then is that what, if I were to break it down for the folks who don't have that, connection mm -hmm. right because of colonial trauma whatever it is that creates that those distances and whatever in relationships it really is about love yeah love and community mm -hmm. mm. that's love, love. that's how i would say and how we show up yeah and how we strengthen ourselves because we have that base and how we 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 pour into that base those people that community, that yeah. family, those relationships, 
because they hold us up as we go forward. It's true. How do I recognize that I am that community? How do I recognize that? How do I not deny myself the, the, the joys of knowing that I am a ripple effect of that great thing in practice? How do I not deny myself that heavenly experience to know that I am a beautiful extension of that at work rather than wanting to get to the beautiful extension? You know, we're like, while well, celebrating it, that's the way the self love from I love me because I, 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 and I love you because I see you and I recognize myself in you and where we are and who we are. And I can only do that from looking inside myself. True. Yeah. I won't deny it. That's why. And, I, and then I just come home to my. So maybe you're right. You know, the relationship with my parents, I honor that because I did receive that balance. You know, that. Yeah, it's profound. I mean, what your parents gave you is like, that's. Yeah. I hate to say it, but it's rare. <laughs> it's rare. Yeah. yeah. You know, and, I, and that's not to say don't put it out there. I'm just saying, yeah. no, it's beautiful. It's a beautiful vision of what is possible. Yeah. You know, because I think sometimes folks can get wrapped up in, I don't have that. I'd never have that. That's impossible. But no, it's actually, it's, it's possible. It is possible. I don't want to be the one in the total opposite and say it is possible, you know, because of my experience, you know. You know, because I realize that out of that, the selfish perspective comes home and you will find joy in that, where a lot of people find joy in, in the, 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 the community that comes from, you know, the other way of practicing. So, you know, I mean, it's, it's important. Where I see where some people say, Yo, that's not to say it be selfish, but um, self-awareness. The, the, the joy, not to say the joys, but the metrics <clears throat> of individuality and the importance of it when it comes to shaping a togetherness, a we and where we are. So accountability. So you then find that, yeah, at times it will come across as selfish to a person who chooses not to practice these things. And then you have to understand that and make room for that misunderstanding. But yeah, sometimes you, you, accountability does come across as that so then you'll find a misunderstanding you know mm. well i'm gonna yeah. have to i'm gonna have to reflect on that for a bit i think yeah yeah that's yeah that's something all new to me but i'll i'll sit with that and okay. i'll let that i'll let that seep into my being and, yeah i wanted uh, maybe just you know i think i'm trying to ex expand on uh, is it selfishness is the right word because of the negative connotation that it carries what does it do for a person when it comes to practicing accountability I guess maybe if you explain what accountability Context. It is. We can work from it. I am where I am. My yes and my no's brought me to where I am. Mm -hmm. the, the, um, the, the ethics that I practice, which have to do with family, I see how they then benefit the outer space, which is a home, a community, a village, a people. Yeah, there's um choices that you 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 will it's a knowing that that is what goes without question that sometimes you know, a way of work that one has to apply that doesn't really become too apparent to a person which is walking in a total opposite manner because mm -hmm. they're experiencing life in a different way where it is yeah, where they're approaching life from A village makes a child. A village makes, it takes a village to raise a child. It takes a village to raise a child. So we will surrender the child to the village. 
at times, rather than saying, what is it that makes a village? So we surrender a child to a village, to a space where the village is non-existent. Mm. Yeah, so I won't even start at the village raise a child. I'm just busy building a village. I'm busy building a, what it takes to make a village, knowing that the child will be safe once the village is there. You know? Mm. So, so I, I guess I'm approaching, I try to say the, the metrics, when it comes to approaching it from the other end, they will change and they will seem foreign, you know? Mm. Mm. Yeah, nation building and these things. So sometimes they come across as you can see them. Yeah, yeah. I had to find a new direction. I had to make a new selection. All that anger misdirected It took a while for me to redirect it Family, you pray for me so I'm protected Give thanks for everything we're blessed with it Took it for a fool, that was a blessing it Took it for a fool, that was a lesson People forgive you when them love you Plus ain't will resurrect you from the problem No will leave our people in the struggle No will leave our youths in them public And at them we come feel liberated Write the good songs and deliver it Love is all I bring, I know deliver it Every man want the mother smile over our dinner plate Can't be me alone, alright We not tone From what day yeah, I've been in a zone Bad boy cologne, catch the smell when the king a room Chant a couple psalms, wicked off you leave the king alone Impress men and brings balance and never the king alone King in a heart, all the people say man a king a road Still a search what been a plan to find my thing a road I had to use my eyes to listen Never missing. Such a delight to meet your sister. Such a delight you like this system, chapel. I had to redefine my vision. I had to seek to find my mission. I fell asleep inside a prison. When I woke up, I was a prison. My lighthouse and every high street. Sharing with the world when we learn from this my sea. Make all the I see. You don't need to have a high seat. Forget respect, no, you make it now for I see. The I see it, no, get correct, the eyesight. If it not clean, then me not connect me eyesight to it. Darkness can disconnect this bright light. Fit the balance is what I fight. And we still don't need no pie pie. A just job. Only trust job. It's a most job. I know it's yours job. A just job. Just ja, and it's a must ja. Sing some songs and remember bridging them boys sing a road. Nah, I mean, I just wrote to let you know, and he told me let you go. Oh, why? It's time to say goodbye. Mama told me let you know, she thought you were special, but mm-hmm. so did I. Every challenge, man, I feel fight to keep the balance. Another thing that's quite apparent, man, I feel utilize them talent. Oh, can't deviate from the mission. No, ambition make your vision grow. Ambition make your vision grow. Oh. Life is a journey whenever you cross the water. Quench your thirst and don't you ever block the bridge. 
When you are climbing, never you throw a stone behind you. Living up so grand, it teach me how to live. I've met so many good people on my journey. Cock out the smiles that I've seen. I'm so grateful I got to share my life. You never will never be better. building yeah what do people mean by that when people practice nationalism and they're patriotic about a way of practice and then it becomes a thing that a tribe of people have to follow yeah as i go you know it forms nations it's the same things that they use to shape nations and for sake of honor and the principles that people fight for and their reason you know people provide reason that's the reason that's where we have we have we have nations, we have rulers of worlds. We have no rulers of the earth. If you notice, no one's bold enough to take that stance, not in our time space. We just have rulers of worlds, and you realize the world is you know based upon the perspective you're holding. So we have people, you know. Does that make sense? World leaders mm. and no earth leaders. Mm. Yeah, then underneath that, we have different nations and countries, straight back down to the communities and tribes and families. Gotcha. So when you're, yeah. when you're talking about, and when you're putting family at the core and the center. Yeah. Um, you're saying that that's the, and that, okay, I get it now. So that's the mm. basic unit. And you're saying that yeah. the same way that you can have like a top down, sort of like, the ruler of the world can shift and change a family system yeah. a family system itself can shift and change the world yeah gotcha same way same way same metrics same metrics same, same metrics way. that work gotcha it's, it's a, yeah so then if i want to affect the world in my the beginning of my musical career, my thing was, oh, I was always been my dream to save the world. So here I come. I had a cape on. I had that, that there was so much that I wanted to do outside. And then I said, no, wow. I'm doing so much outside because my parents did so much on the inside. Why, well, if I even want to affect the world, sometimes the best thing you could do is get together with someone and then also create another beautiful experience that someone else is going to meet. Oh my God, which brings us to your love song. <laughs> Aren't you just known for those? <laughs> Valentine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, that's my thing. It's your that's thing. My, my thing. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm trying to do that. I want to do that. I want to be that for someone. And then I also want to meet that experience doing that and meeting that coming from so there's someone else's parents out there that did a whole different dance, a whole different thing. And then in comes the moments as it intertwines and wow, our worlds are aligned. How now crossing paths. Wow, that's amazing. I, I love these things in life. <laughs> that's beautiful. Yeah. Uh, yes. So um there, there are a few love songs on, on your album, huh? Yeah. Which one shall we start with? Like, I loved Heli because it's so simple. It's just so beautiful. <laughs> and then you've Heli. got so simple straight after Heli. Yeah, man, because it's so simple. <laughs> <laughs> it's love. <laughs> you see, Eli, Empress, you know, you have the powers to Eli, mm. Mama Earth. We call it so many different things for the feminine, the great feminine, the Omega energy, your, your own mother sister that thing you know that essence that thing that i have to also recognize in my own in my own self and like i'm calling on that that's what that's the kind of energy that i would then tap into to then probably profess something like that you know where it's all beautiful and rosy. you can feel that if you have close your eyes you can feel it that nature, something that nature nurtured. Yeah. 
that is that that I'm just giving homage to, but at the same time recognizing that it's it is it is that this woman beautiful thing that a woman is that I just love that only a woman can be for me that I just want to celebrate all the time, you know. As the most I can do, I'll be it, I can celebrate it. You know. That's beautiful. I mean, like, yeah, it's it seems kind of like cliche these days when people say you can only love someone the way that you love yourself, you know? But, um, True. And I think, uh, but I think what people maybe are now coming to an awareness of is just how important it is to nurture the feminine within. Mm-hmm regardless of how you present in the world, you know? I think um, even people who call themselves women sometimes don't realize and recognize how important it is to nurture the feminine energy, mm. you know? Yeah. Same way, you know, men have that problem too, people who are identify as men. Um, we're learning it, because we learn it one way, you know? We learn this, is it young? Mm. Yeah, we know who we are on the thing. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, my well, energy can be very yang. Yeah, well, it's, we just learn it one way. In a world you know? that requires us to be so yang all the time. Yeah, yeah, man. You know, it's that whole time thing again. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, the whole, the whole time is just a yang vibe. So we've, I learned that. Imagine that. You know, I had my battles with that. Mm. Many different relations. I mean, look, I'm nosy, so I want to ask, but I won't go there because... I, I don't like to put people's private lives out there like that. Yeah. But um, if that was you know, I will, I'll, I'll ask you another time. <laughs> yes, yes. This is a message to my empress. The truth. Mama, hey. The power to heal I just I say how I feel I am make it reveal I thank you It's such a gift there's no deny Ja bless you with the powers to heal I in a real life oh. So far away But oh so You know you have the power to heal us. I am make it with feel Thank you. You're such a gift, there's no deny. Most times I bless you with the powers to heal us in a real life. I know I've been trouble. You pick me up when I stumble You provide comfort in this jungle You don't know Impress you up the power to people asking questions mm-hmm. <laughs> which one was it i'll be there i'll be there mm. i'll be there i'll be there i'll be there 
Someone to love you. I'll be there, I'll be there, I'll be there. In this life and the next. <laughs> yeah, that's one of my favorites. It's beautiful. Yeah, with no regrets. Yeah. She's just an optimist running through a bucket list. There's a, you know, a, a, a lot of my brothers can agree, and a lot of my sisters will agree that they've met this experience in life. You know, sometimes we're just going through it, and um, we have our perspective, we have our visions, and our vision boards, and our object- objective list. And there's we. An old man told me that, yo, you get 100 years. This is time again. He said, you get 100 years. What are you going to do? So we're all looking at it as if we're on our way out and there's this much that we have to do before we leave. You know, I've practiced that and I've met it, you know. And then it came a personal song. Yeah, I think... A lot of people can relate to that. <laughs> <laughs> the feeling of time is running out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We're in a rush. We're in a rush. And we just want to get it right. It's took a while before me to say it. I, we've already won. I've already won. The most I trophy. That's the second song on the album. Mm. It took a while for me to say that. Oh, we are the trophy. It's a lady uh, and, and in the 2020 noise, you know, she was reading a, a few Bible verses and introduced me to some different church concepts, you know, and I just loved the conversation because it was geared towards an a interview. And then she said, yeah, it's written that we are the trophy. So we are... Because if we are God's trophy, something like that, you know. And it made me think of every other fight that you consider that's probably been fought. We're probably here because we survived all of that noise. Wow. We are the trophy of every moment. We are the victors at work. You know, we just the walk. Your walk is a victory walk. Yeah. And, and that was beautiful to run into. <laughs> what was that? Yeah, that was a beautiful knowing to run into. Mm. Yeah. yeah, I love how that flows in from like your a prayer for you, you know, because you say that the folks you're put in a position, right, are just trying to find yeah. a way out. Yeah. And then yeah, yeah. once you understand that you are already the highest trophy, like yeah. once you break with that illusion that, yeah, man. you know, it's all good. But then it also impacts like, how you are in relationship with other people. Yeah. Yeah, so you remember compassion, mindfulness, and everybody's personal work. Yeah, you make room. And that is all we have time for today on Anity Rhythms. My name is Sister Za, your co-host here every last two Thursdays of the month. We've been listening to a really in-depth interview with Randy Valentine, a creator and creative based in South London. In part three coming up, we'll get into his love songs. But until then, thank you for your attention and love. And if you'd love to listen back to these interviews and to the radio show in general, please remember to uh, check out our radio on demand function at 3cr.org.au forward slash inity rhythms that's 3cr.org.au forward slash inity rhythms